Oh, 84 degrees was your high temperature. It's a good late afternoon. The greatest city in the world and a summertime look, right? LaGuardia in an 85, 87 degrees in Newark. You see the temperatures real mild, real nice and really pleasant and temperatures summer like. Now this is going to change in the next couple of days. Holding in the 70s tomorrow, it's about negative seven compared to today. Uh, and again, just about right for this time of year. Keep in mind, we have had the driest spell since November of 2000 now and 23 and the beat goes on. I don't see any rain coming in here. Uh, upstate New York, we're in the 70s, east and west of the Hudson, Nassau and Suffolk County, you're in the 70s. High pressure is building on in. This is dry air. It's heavy air. It's sinking. This storm is pulling away. Nice combo. All the heat will retrogress to the west and what we're left with is a cooler flow. Watch the high come in. Watch the storm pull out and watch the moisture retrogress in the opposite direction. So it looks like it's moving our way, but then again, it begins to pull away and weaken. So I like the map a lot, and Cruz and I in agreement. Not much going on here in terms of rain until we get middle part of next week, maybe Tuesday or Wednesday. And what's happening in the tropics? Really not much. Remember the long range outlook projection active? Not so. We have to get two hurricanes a day to meet that projection. So I think this season, on the whole, is quieting down. But again, you got to watch the Gulf of Mexico and uh, the Caribbean as we rotate back into the latter part of this month in October. 67 degrees, a lot of clouds. 56 in the suburbs, 79 sun and clouds, a little cooler. 74 to 81. You want nice? You got it. You got the uh, jets tonight. You got that. Over the weekend, you got fall, 844 a.m. You like it cooler? Temps are going to be in the upper 60s. You like it? I love it.